How's everybody doing? Welcome back to my channel. This week, I got my client for the next two days and we're gonna be doing an outer sleeve. On the top area, we're gonna be doing a gorilla. And on the bottom portion is gonna be a lion. I'm excited for this project. There's gonna be a lot of contrast, a lot of detail, and a lot of fur, and a lot of texture. But first thing is first, let's answer a few emails and books on new clients, and let's get this video started. Let's go! Okay, I'm ready. Okay. Ah, let me introduce this place first. So this, is, this right here, is Queen's uh, studio where she does all kinds of classes: Zumba, boxing, boot camp, and um, this is this is for her business here. So if anybody's from AZ, come through. Bring your kids. No, don't bring them. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you get them. No, don't bring. That's the how kids. you get them. <laughs> Ladies, leave the kids at home <laughs> and come dance. Now I did save a couple of people that I was looking at to see um, if you would be interested in them. Ooh. Okay, so one, he is wanting a full back cover up. You up for the challenge? <laughs> Let me see what he has first. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is his back. So he's got the line Damn. and the moon in there. It's just not how he envisioned it. it doesn't look scarred. First of all, I want to say your work is spectacular. Thank no. You. Amazing? Oh. <laughs> Question mark. <laughs> <laughs> also, my brother wants to get a cover up as well, and his tattoo is super faded, so maybe you could do both. They you try to put, it, put his brother in there. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyways, I have a back tattoo that I have one covered up. I live in New York City and in the military. It seems like he's open. Sounds like he, he's pretty much open to suggestions. I'll do it. I'll do it. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, another one. Okay. I'm interested in getting a medium-sized back piece done to cover up my existing tattoo. He's got a lower back tattoo. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say no. No? Uh, no. Solo para saber si tienes citas disponibles. La idea que tengo es de un lobo de frente y el lugar sería en el pecho. Uh, I'm gonna uh. pass. I was wanting a tattoo of the DC comic Steppenwolf. Uh, I'm gonna have to pass. Okay. I don't feel like it's my style. We tried to reply to everybody, um, but yesterday we last checked and we have a total of like 1,174. Kevin yes. is extremely blessed because I remember when he first started doing emails, he was just like, nobody's gonna email me, we should just keep doing DMs. And now he's completely blessed that he has 1,174 people wanting to get tattooed by him. I think that's amazing. Yeah. But be patient. You know, I feel very grateful for so many of you that want to get tattooed by me. So I want you guys to understand that not because you send an email, doesn't mean that you're gonna get booked, you know? It just means that I'm gonna consider it and make sure that whatever you send or your idea that you uh, emailed us, I'm gonna be excited for it because I wanna make sure that I'm excited because if I book you, I'm gonna give you 110%. Oh, and then just make sure that you have all the information in your email and a lot of the times if you don't tell us what you want, your email will just kinda get overlooked. Just as much as information as you guys could give us is gonna help us um, get you in and see if your piece is something that is um, that is of interest to Mr. Reyes. <laughs> <laughs> Call me babe. <laughs> <laughs> We're on the clock. <laughs> <laughs> um, another one. Hello. The subject is professional gamer with a horrible half sleeve in need of a miracle. Currently, I travel the world to play video games. What? Oof. He's living your dream. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> For a long time, Kevin was considering becoming a professional gamer. No, you were, let me you were no, really, no, 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 you no. were really considering Not it. Not a gamer. Like I only play Rocket League. That's it. <laughs> Currently, I travel the world to play video games, and it's pretty cool, except for one problem: this tattoo on my right arm. As for the design of the tattoo, I think giving you full freedom to make something we will both be extremely happy with is is a play. Oh, oh. You're holding it backwards. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's backwards. 
Oh. <laughs> I'll take it. Okay. I'll take it. Okay, this person just says, how much is a cover-up? How much is a cover-up? Yeah. Yeah. Hi, I would like to make an appointment uh, with you. Good morning, very interested in setting up an appointment. Uh, My name is Juan, and I'm interested in setting an appointment up with you to cover up my tribal tattoo, which oh. will be attached down below. It's really dark. Oh. It's really, really, really Tribals are always tricky. It's really dark. Some of the skin is like lifted. Close your eyes. Okay, go. Oof. As much as I want to, I can't take it. It's too, too uh. dark. Hello, my name is Kelsey, and I've seen all your amazing cover-ups on TikTok and Instagram, and I love your work. I'm looking to get my moon tattoo on my upper arm covered up. I'm thinking a goddess design and for it to be half a sleeve. It's not a bad tattoo either. Mm -mm. Damn, a goddess can be like really soft. Well, I mean, it's like right at the top yeah. of her thing. So, so maybe, maybe that could be like the crown or something. And then, that, and then like the bottom. Too. Mm -hmm. I'll take it. Let's do it. Ding, 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 Two nights ago. Oh! <laughs> <sighs> that was intense. All right, I want a snack. Okay. Let's go. All right, ready? You follow my lead. Okay. But I don't want you slacking, all right? Okay. Look, I don't want to make you look bad or anything. All right. Start off with a little. And you gotta dive yeah, sheen. Yup, yup, yup. And you gotta speed it up a little bit. You gotta speed it up. <laughs> Dude, you came in super comfortable. Yeah, I did. You see the slippers and everything, yeah. bro? I'm ready for a long day, bro. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> uh, you should have just brought a blanket yeah, in here. Yeah, I know, bro. <laughs> you see, I got the sweater, bro, the hoodie. <laughs> How long has it been the last time you got tattooed? Five years, you said? Yeah, it's been like five years since About I got tattooed. About five man. years. So, Gee. was the last session a big project or a uh, quick little I, session? I got a, you know, a uh, medium-sized piece on my arm, so right. nothing too, nothing like this, nothing like this at all. <laughs> yeah. So that's for sure. This is probably gonna be your first one, huh? This is my biggest piece for sure. Oh, Heck yeah! Shit. God damn! <laughs> hey! <laughs> Sheesh! All right, here we go. Oh, Center. That's crazy. Mm. That's hard. Damn. Sheesh. All right, perfect placement. Go ahead Thank and check out the placement. Make sure you like what you see. Oh, yeah, bro. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's sick, bro. You ready? Yeah, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's go, bro. Let's get it. Let's go.
So in this area right now, I'm in the forehead. I'm on the forehead of the gorilla. And I started doing this technique that I don't think I've talked about before in none of my videos. So it's a good spot to kind of take you guys through my thought process and how I'm doing this area and how I would execute this little fur uh, on the forehead. So it is a little tricky on how to do the hand movement or the way I do my hand movement. And I slowly practice this for a couple months until I got, I got it. It is one of those techniques that I'm pretty sure you don't see on a daily basis. And yeah, I'm about to show you guys how the way I do it. So I'm using a 27 curve Mac with a voltage of a 5.0. And what I'm gonna be doing is doing this motion, going up and down. And at the same time, I'm gonna be rotating my Mac like this. It is a crazy technique, trust me. And make sure that it, the highlights are where they're supposed to be, the dark tones are where they're supposed to be. So um, you gotta multitask. I really, really like this technique because I'm able to move a little bit faster without thinking about it too much. See that? There you go, that's how we're doing. I'm gonna keep doing the same thing throughout the whole entire forehead. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I would encourage you guys to give it a try. It's gonna be a little bit challenging at first because you gotta move your hand up and down and rotate your, your fingers at the same time. So it is a little bit challenging to uh, get the hang of it at first. But once you get it, that's it. I bet your body's already exhausted. Oh man, long day for sure. Long day, <laughs> worth it. But long. <laughs> long day. Yeah. Pretty much the end of day one. Yes, yeah, sir. Heck yeah, ten man. minutes. How did it feel after five years of not getting tattooed? Man, it's a breath of fresh air for sure. <laughs> like definitely a little different. <laughs> yeah, that was different. Man. Was it what you were expecting? Um, but, man, it was smooth actually. I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, I was thinking it's gonna be a little more brutal coming after five years getting such a big piece, but uh, mm -hmm. man, that was actually the time was flying. So every time I looked, I felt like we knocked out a huge chunk of it. Yeah, yeah. Were you nervous that you you were gonna tap out? Um, I just never had a big piece, so I was just kind of like, all right, we'll see how this goes, man. I was like, <laughs> I definitely can't. I told myself you definitely can't tap out, man. You, you signed up for this. So. <laughs> it's like no, you gotta do you it. You gotta do it. Where was uh, the most painful part? Of the thigh. Oh man, I think the I think the back of the thigh a little the bit. Back of the thigh. And then like kind of that top, that top. Oof. Like around the hip area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think the back is sensitive for sure. Like yeah. Right here, huh? <laughs> uh -huh. back. The back was a little tough. It was a little raw back there. Ah, damn. All right, check it out. On that mirror. Oh. Day one. Day one. <laughs> Completed. Oh, oh man. That is hard, bro. Oh. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. It's gone now. That's huge. That's hard. That's huge. I appreciate bro. that. Oh, yeah, that's aggressive. But no, uh, she. <laughs> Shit. God. Look, baby. Thank you. That's thank my girl Jasmine, hi. my son, Pharaoh. He's probably doing? just waking up. Hi. Say hi, Bubba. Hi. <laughs> he just hi. woke oh, up. Oh, he's like, well, who, who is this? Hi. <laughs> One day, knock that yeah, out. That's crazy, day. huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Tomorrow's gonna be the lion. Yeah, put the thing. Set it off. Bottom piece. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I tried to, I tried to show that didn't right. work. Oh, that didn't oh, work. Oh, I'm not flexible as it is. So. Oh yeah, I appreciate that, bro. Oh yeah, it was my pleasure. Oh my god. You sleep? I slept pretty good, bro. Yeah. You're I was trying out. to stay off of it. I was on one side on that. I was sleeping on this side, but <laughs> <laughs> did the sheets get stuck to your leg? Yeah. yeah oh man. I They're white. To... 
No, I got black sheets on. I got black sheets on. You know? <laughs> I know better than that. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm excited to finish it today. That's this is going to complete the whole thing. It's so, man, you, you, made, you made the tattoo look hella sick on Instagram. <laughs> bro, I got, yeah, I got, a lot of, I got a lot of feedback, bro. I was like, ah, oh, shit, I don't even know if he wants me sending all these people because he's <laughs> so booked already. Bro. Yeah, I was, I was watching the story, and I'm like, oh, damn. I was like, I look saucy as hell. <laughs> One time, I remember that when I first, you know, I probably had like two years tattooing. Yeah. So my, my work wasn't as good, obviously. Yeah, but yeah, I, yeah. I know the kind of quality I had, you know what I mean? Of course. So <laughs> one of my clients, he got a Arizona across his neck. At that time, I was still doing lettering, you know? I was, yeah, I was, yeah. I was taking whatever was coming my way. <laughs> so I was like, I'll, I'll take this Arizona lettering. I was like, I'll do a little bit of script. I was like, all right, yeah, yeah. I feel really good about this one. So I took a couple pictures, you know, and, and then I sent him these pictures. I sent my client the pictures. You know, because I, I I want them to have like a nice a nice little copy of their tattoo. You know. Yeah. Took my time to take pictures, and then this fool goes home, <laughs> <laughs> and then goes inside the bathroom, oh, and no. twists his arm like this, and then he takes the picture. Oh shoot! With the plastic on. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then bleeding, bro. <laughs> I was like, oh, and then this fool has the audacity to tag me on the caption. Oh, and yeah. He says, follow my boy for some sick work. <laughs> I'm like, not with that Dang. kind of picture, bro. You're promoting me the wrong way. <laughs> They're bleeding still. Dang. I was like, bro, I sent you pictures. <laughs> I was like, oh. All right, here we go. Line it up. Actually, I'm going to have you stand up for this one. All right, cool. Sheesh. Right. Oh, yeah, that's a spot. After getting two days back to back, outer sleeve, how does that feel like? 
Uh, accomplished for sure, man. It's definitely been a journey. It's definitely been a journey. Uh, crazy 48 hours, but uh, yeah. smooth process, and I'm glad we, we're wrapping it up. It looks super dope, so yeah. I'm super excited yeah. to show this thing off, man. I'm excited too, because I feel like I was, you know, the way everything flows is crazy. Yeah. And uh, it just fits, like, I, you know, because there's tattoos that they look good, but do they look good with the person? Exactly. Sometimes it doesn't work like that, you know? <laughs> the piece doesn't match the, the person, and I feel like with this, it's like, it matches your personality. Such a big tattoo, you, it can be intimidating. It can, yeah. For anybody, you For know? sure. Even for me. I had to kind of psych myself out a little bit. Mm -hmm. The bottom, you know, that uh, the shin was a little tough. Oh, the shin, huh? Yeah, I just felt like, because there's a, I don't know if it was vibrating on the bone or what, but. It's always cringy too, because when I hit the bone, it's kind of like a rrr, rrr, rrr. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm like, oh my God, bro. I don't know if it hurt or what it was, but it was a weird feeling I ain't used to, so. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that was different. So we went at it for the first piece. So the top area, it was probably like, what, seven hours? Yeah, easy. And then the bottom here, six, mm -hmm. around six hours. Pretty good time, pretty good time. That's 13 hours. 13 hours later. Uh, like I'll I have said. you turn a little bit to your side. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, oh. Oh, my bad, my, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> that thing don't even got feeling no more, bro. The back. <laughs> This He's is, like, yeah, I didn't feel nothing. <laughs> <laughs> your back's gonna be more sore than your yeah, thighs. Exactly. <laughs> exactly.